Hello, all my lovely pennant pals. It's your girl Renee with Patina Deville Designs. Today is Plan With Me Sunday, and um, it's actually the week, or going to be the week, of um, St. Patrick's Day. So we're going to uh, mix it up. I'm going to do things a little bit, I think, a little bit more spicy than just regular um, leprechauns and, <laughs> and uh, what else? Shamrocks and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to use a couple of my pinup girl looking stickers that I got from Timu that I thought were really fun that have more of the green kind of, um, vibe to them. And of course the red head, I thought she was super spicy. And then I found a couple of green stickers that I might put in here. We'll see. I'm still want to think do some rainbows. I thought these were really cute. I think I got these off of, let me see if those can come out. Okay. Um, Timu. So there's like a nice, beautiful green. And then we have a rainbow looking, um, colored one there. So I don't know if you can see that or not. And then this one's really fun. It just reminded me of like Lucky Charms with all the little stars. So yeah. Okay. So let's get to, uh, oh, and then I'm going to use these two sticker books to help me decorate. These are both happy planners. Oops. Let me get that in frame. Um, we have the seasonal one here from Wrong Wrong. And then we have the, the neon lights, but this one has got a lot of the rainbows. So, so I want to do that. I thought that would be fun. All right, so if you guys are ready to start planning, why don't you, um, I guess if you're, if you want to do this with me and just kind of hang out, pause the video really quick, go grab your coffee or whatever you're doing, whatever you're drinking, and we'll just hang out for a few minutes and we'll, we'll decorate our planners together. Um, yeah. Okay. So if you're doing that, I'll see you in a second. If not, here we go. So I am using the sheets from my, my personal planner, the pinup planner, and these are the ones they start on Mondays and they end over here on Sunday. So it's nice where you have a, a work week, more of a work week on one side and kind of like your weekend on the other. Um, each one of these uh, weekly spreads has a, as you can see all along the bottom here, this is the next strip. These are all your mood tracker, so you can keep track of your moods. And then it has a weather tracker is the next one and a sleep tracker. And then over here, it has incoming packages for you to track here. Or if you purchase something and you want to keep track of it, you could do that here or in the notes. Um, I think that's helpful because sometimes we forget, especially if they come from like Timu or, um, you know, Alibaba Express, they take a little longer. And so it's nice to write that down. Then you can remember in the future. I have a section for planning your meals for the week. I like to morph this a little bit. I don't do breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks. I do just all my dinners for the week. So, because I think that... You know, the other ones are a little easier to deal with, but dinners always seem to be the hardest, right? So I feel like if I have my dinners kind of planned out for the week, I know what my grocery trip or, you know, shopping trip is going to be like, as well as um, just it, it, it's one less thing to think about. So I kind of wipe this out and then I just do M like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. In the middle over here, I do Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And so that's how I do mine every single week. I have a little, this is just a little space here, but you know, for a little shopping list, if you need to write, you know, eggs, whatever, just something small. Then over here, I actually do have what I'm thankful for. So a little section for positive affirmations or maybe something that happened good that week or that you're looking forward to happening. And then I also have um, a habit tracker here. So yeah. Um, I do this one here. Um, I'm probably, I loved the little circles, but now I'm realizing I think that they're hindrance a little bit. So I'm probably the next model personally. I just kind of white out for my steps so I can write in how many steps per day. That's like, but the other ones like for my Bible and my faith planner, I, the check marks work, works great. But sometimes for things like the steps, it's nice to be able to be able to write in the how many steps per day. So anyways, that's just my little that's that. Okay. So let's see here. All right. How's the weather like in your guys's area? I don't know where everybody's at. Um, I think we're looking for more rain in, uh, in Northern California. Um, which I'm grateful cause we need to, we need the rain in this area. Um, <coughs> pardon me. Let's see. I'm going to do this here. I know I want to do, I think I want to do like this little one or do I want to do it with this one? Hmm. Let's get this figured out here. So there might be times that I get quiet, but you know, like, Hey, if you're here planning with me, I'm sure you don't mind the silence. So it'd be maybe a little 
what's it called, ASMR during when I'm doing this. But yeah, where's my little, where's my tool to cut this? Oh, there it is. I should have had that ready. Sorry guys. Okay. I'm gonna give this a go here. Oh, darn it, it messed it all up. It's like not tight enough. Now we gotta move it over. Oh, I should, you know, I could have just put a sticker there. Oh well. Oh well. I learned a trick though recently. Like, you know, sometimes when things get too sticky, um, there, who was it? It was another planner lady. And what she does is she puts them on her arm first and kind of gets some of the stick off. So they're easier to manage on the page. And I thought that was just genius. YouTube University, man, you learned so much. Okay, here we go. Let me hold this down a little tighter so I don't have the tear problem like I did. There we go, much better. I'm grab my X-Acto knife. I've said this before, it's it's just um, interesting how things are changing. You know, like before my time that I would do my planning was just my time alone and I would sit with myself and maybe watch YouTube videos here hanging out, you know, or you know, listen to a podcast, but now that I'm doing this like online, you know, as in front of everybody, it's, it's a weird sensation. I'm, you know, so that's why sometimes I'm quiet because I'm so used to just being quiet, um, by myself. So bear with me as I learn to be somewhat entertaining <laughs> or at least hopefully not too annoying. You know, I just don't want to bore you guys, but I used to love to watch planning videos and this is a great way for me to showcase my my planner. I may not be all that creative sometimes, but I don't know. It's it's enjoyable to me and I really enjoy it. But I just don't want to be too chatty either. So I'm I think I'm gonna do this on each side and see which one I like the best because I'm really being torn right now on how I want to do this. <sighs> Let's see here. Come on now work with me. Oh there it is right there. Oh, did you guys see? I did my nails. These are those Dollar Tree ones that I was telling you about. Here, look at, look at, look at. These cost me, oops, sorry, my light was falling. Don't fall light. These are the ones, they were only $1.25, and I got, these are the mint green ones, so I figured that'd be cute for St. Patty's Day, but look it. So these are considered the petite ones, but they, they fit my nails. So, and yeah, I'm like super excited about them. I think they're probably meant for like, you know, teenagers, but <laughs> it works for me. I was stoked. Yeah, I um I glue on my own nails and they last about a week, sometimes longer depending on how rough I am on them. Okay, so my thought is just to kind of put this in the center. I think that would be pretty. Oh, I'm it's not so it's fine here, and then down at the end it gets crooked. I'm actually filming this pretty late on a Saturday. My husband is on a fishing trip. So I'm at home alone right now, and I honestly have had a blast. I have been batch recording <laughs> all my videos Wishing I had more money so I could keep recording videos because I'm having a blast. I'm really liking this little rubber, the rainbow one though. That's so pretty, especially with the green. Oh, yes. And then maybe I'll just do these along the top because those are fun. Figure something out here. Okay, let's get, let's leave that there. And I'm going to put this one here. And then I think I'm going to use these as, make some boxes out of them too. That's not working. I hope I'm in frame. I keep forgetting to look. So my youngest son and his girlfriend just came over and hung out. And it was a lot of fun. Those two are so adorable together. If you guys hear some noises in the background, it's my pups. They're wanting to know what mom's doing. Oh, hang on. There's 
those. Okay, I just need to line this up a little bit more. I know it's not that bad, but it's going to drive me nuts. Okay, come on now. Be good. And these exacto knives are so sharp, so you have to be very careful. Otherwise, this is going to be a like a true crime <laughs> with blood everywhere. <laughs> okay, look how cute that looks already. I just love the little rainbows. Um, let me see which boxes that we have before I start filling in with other stuff really quick. Let's do that. Um, okay, I do think that I want to put her down here. I don't know if I'm going to use these ones or not. I'm still trying to figure it out. I just thought they were, you know, cute green and yellows and, but look at, we got a, a green in her. Isn't she cute? A little sassy thing. But look at this red head. Does that not scream Irish? Beautiful. And this one's a little sassy thing. Look at her with the, I love the green. So, yeah. I think I might have even did a, last year, um, spread was like this too. Um, okay, so here we go. Let me see here. Move this out of the way really quick. So I want to pull out. So I need... I want to use that one, the St. Patrick's Day, which I think is on Sunday. So it'll go over here somewhere. And then there is some other, like we've got some greens here to use. Um, that didn't have too, too much, but I found a few things. So here, like a little shamrock guy, we'll use, I'm gonna pull them out right now, just so I don't forget. We'll use that one. It's like a softer green though, but oh well. I'm just gonna put it over here somewhere so I can remember that I have it. Might as well pull out the other one too. Maybe here. I need to get one of those wax sheets. You know, so I can just kind of like prep my stickers. Okay, I think there was a few more. I thought I saw some, maybe it's the other book. So bear with me really quick while I kind of look at a couple of these. This is more of like a summary. See, this is, there they are. Okay, I knew I saw some. All right, I'm gonna leave that open and put it to the side really quick. So I know that's that. And then the rainbows. Let me find the rainbows really quick. There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna utilize some of these too. Because I think that's pretty. Pretty, pretty. Okay, maybe a box. Over here with a rainbow. Here, I'm gonna mark this guy. Okay. I feel like I'm getting ahead of myself, starting to get overwhelmed. Because I might do the stars, the top, and right here. Or do I want more rainbows? Well, that's the great thing about it. It can come off if I don't like it, right? Let's just give it a go. They're so cute. They're so cute. It's crazy because like the, I have this gapping, I guess, between my boxes and it's just about perfect for these little, um, washi tapes that come from Timu. I couldn't believe how tiny they were. When I first got them, I was like, oh my goodness. How am I going to use those? Looks like I'm using them just fine. 
Yeah, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Let's give it a go. I'll put the other one over here. Because I just, I don't know. St. Patty's Day has always been about, like, it reminds me of the Lucky Charms. Rainbows and shamrocks and leprechauns, green beer, pot of, pot of gold, stuff like that. Anybody ever watch that scary movie from like the 80s, The Leprechaun? Oh, that is creepy. If you're looking for a good 80s flick, that was creepy. Okay, I'm going to see who's listening right now. There was a movie back in the 80s, and so obviously we'll find out, you know, <laughs> I was around my age. There was a movie back in the 80s where these black fluff balls black fluffy balls would roll around and like, I don't know, it was the cheapest, craziest movie, but it scared the bejesus out of me. I used to run from my house to the car, quickly put my feet in because like in the movie, that's when they would like attack people. <laughs> Definitely as a kid, I should not have watched that. So here, what I'm wondering is, is who can tell me the name of the movie? Put it in the um, comments below. I'd love to see who knows. <laughs> so, yeah let's see okay um do I want to do the rainbow at the top yeah we'll do maybe more stars at the top we'll do the stars at the top where'd it go and then oh dang it oh no it's in the abyss one second while I jump down and grab that my desk is like a standing desk but I have what it's what is it called um like a bar stool type thing so jumping down oh okay I got it I'm back so let's see here last week I did a um a plan with me but I did it on like the speed mode on my phone and you know it was like a 20 minute video and I literally thought it would be like I don't know five minutes long and it was 34 seconds it, it was like a short but I turned it into a movie. I was like, eh, whoever wants to watch it can. <laughs> I was like, oh man, that's crazy. See, I'm not sure if I'm liking it up here. We'll see. We'll see. Because I definitely feel like I need more green, but I might do the green down below. Or at least more of the rainbow one. And something else is coming up. Wait. Okay. Cut this one over here. So when you guys do your planners every week, or if you do, um, do you do the decorations like this? Do you, or sometimes, all the time, is it how you kind of reset? I've only been doing this consistently for about a year and a half. And it just kind of started off being kind of like my therapy time. Like I was like, I'm going to just go and sit and, and would watch the videos and just kind of sit. And it was a time that I got to be creative. So I really enjoyed it. And that's kind of what turned me on to the budgeting stuff too. Because then of course, you know, the planning and the budgeting is kind of connected somewhat. And so... It would YouTube would recommend oh would you like to see this and I was like oh yeah I used to do that that's kind of fun and then I just started watching more and more of that and I just started falling in love with it and I just absolutely love the budgeting community so um, hang on here here we go okay let me pull this to the side and I want to just re Reassess real quick and see what's going down here. It's definitely colorful. I might do the rainbow. Where did it go? It's right here, I think. Yeah. Do I want to do the rainbow with it at the top? I think I, I might like that. Okay, well, let's see here. 
We're just gonna make our own little border at the top. I think that's pretty actually, wow. Alrighty. And my knife, what did I just do with it? It's over here. Okay. Got the song in my head right now. The magically delicious. <laughs> Don't worry, I promise. I see this. I see the knife right next to my hand. I won't let it hurt me. I could feel it moving around. I was like, "Oh, be careful." I bet my dog was like, "Who is she talking to?" <laughs> Probably thinking their mama's crazy. Eh, maybe a little bit. A little crazy is not a bad thing, right? Okay, there we go. So now, let's see here. I'm almost thinking that might be too much rainbow for the rainbows now because it's like kind of different colors. Dang it, let me see here. Well, if I have to peel them up, I can. If I have to. Um, what if I did? Let's see how this goes. We'll see. I don't know if I'm feeling it. I don't know. <laughs> I just feel like it's not quite, maybe the, maybe it's cause it's, I feel like it's clashing with what I had envisioned for my pinups. I think that's what's the problem. So, okay. For me anyways, it's just not quite, not feeling it. Okay, I already like that better. Yep. <clears throat> okay, now I gotta figure out where these ladies are gonna go. Where's my boxes gonna go? So we can close this guy up. I don't think I need that at all. Put it away. <sighs> so another little fun story. I was cleaning my house today has been gone, kind of doing some deep cleaning stuff, and I pulled out old CDs, because I love CDs, and I um, was playing this old school Frank Sinatra, you know, all the old school people, and it came on um, to The Thrill Is Gone. I don't know if you guys remember that one. It is by B.B. King. Well, the fun story about my dad, when my dad lived in New York, and he was about 15 or 16 years old. <clears throat> I guess he was just kind of out in the streets doing whatever. And one of his buddies was like, hey, hey, you want to make some money right now? And he's like, you know it. And so he like went with my dad. Or my dad went with him. And um, I feel like that needs to be like that. Uh, my dad went with him. And they're basically the, so he's like, oh, we're going to be moving some furniture. Uh, um, so... Somewhere in New York. I, can, I don't even know where. It was just one of those neat stories. It's kind of upside down. Um, so they were um, brought all the furniture upstairs. And my dad said he didn't know who it was. Because, you know, bringing boxes in and this big couch, I guess, is the main thing. 
and it turned around and it was B.B. King, like the B.B. King up in this, you know, high rise apartment or whatever. I can't remember what it was exactly, but either way, I'm like B.B. King, like the guy with the guitar with Lucille. And he said, yes. And he goes, it gets better than that. And I go, what? He goes, he was so grateful for us doing our job. He said, hey, if you guys want, I'll play you a couple of bars. Pulls out the guitar and plays a couple of songs for my dad and the other workers. Like, that's a cool ass story. I was like, dad, that's so neat. So yeah, <laughs> thought that was really, really fun. Okay, I'm now I'm not sure what to do with this guy. It's gonna go there for right now. Um, let's see what we're gonna do with her. What are we gonna do with her? I had one more. Oh, I want to put her somewhere. And I almost feel like this then needs to go somewhere else. We're gonna move this guy. So I try to keep you guys entertained with my f funny family stories. <laughs> I think, uh, I don't know if it's already put out because I just recorded it. Like I told you, I was doing a bunch of batching and it's probably why, but I started talking about something and got emotional and it, this is kind of the next month is an emotional time for me because if you were listening, I was explaining that I went through a period where I had lost, I had like 26 losses in a matter of a six year span. But the the month of um, April is a tough one. So my dad, um, my dad's birthday was April, sorry, uh, March 5th. And then he was in the hospital for a few weeks, ended up going into coma, passing away. Well, my mom, around the same time, the crazy thing is they passed away. They were in the hospital about the same amount of time. And then they passed away within four days of each other, four years apart. Yeah, just craziness. And so, um, and the, then my uncle passed away just a couple of years ago and he actually passed away at 444. So, but, um, also the month of April, besides it being the same, like my mom and dad both passed in April, my best friend who passed away, her birthday's in April. And then my mom and dad's anniversary. There's just a lot of kind of like emotions that usually come up that in that month. Um, so we're leading up to it. But there's also a lot of positive that I try to focus on. It's my son's birthday. It's my granddaughter's birthday. I have actually two granddaughters' birthday. So I focus on that now. But yeah, for a time period there, it got pretty tough. Okay. I digress, right? <laughs> Moving on. Let's see here. Do I want to put it over here? I like her. I know. I think she's going to go down here. She's going to go right here. That's where we're going to put her. We'll cover that up with something. Maybe just white it out because she's cute. So we'll put her there. Um, and I was almost thinking it'd be cute to put her near some flowers. Something. But they're so big. They're such big flowers. Could almost do like a fun I don't know nope I don't not over there anyways not feeling that okay let's see here well I know I'm gonna put her there so let me wipe this out and get moving because I'm all over the place again welcome to my channel <laughs> By the way, all the new subscribers, like, how are you guys? Thanks for coming and hanging out with me. Um, I've had a pretty good influx the last week. It was, uh, gosh, I, probably 20 or more, which, you know, for a small channel is a lot. So I was uh, so grateful for that. Okay, I think I know what I'm going to do here. Or is that going to be the wrong green? Let's see here. I was thinking about just putting there and then maybe her just right there by it okay we're gonna start with that oh I hope this turns out cute I love my pinup stickers I have to get some more oh, come on there we go almost almost so Oh, this is where she did this little unstickiness thing, and I thought that was genius. Okay. Okay, there's one. And maybe we'll just put her 
I feel like I need a, I want her with a box. So it's kind of like a hanging out. Maybe over here. I think that that's cute. Closer over here. So we're going to do Is it crooked? No. Okay, cool. All right. And then we'll put her right about there. Like she's saying something. So curious how many of you guys are planners and budgeters, or if you just do one or the other. I'd love to know that too. It's another little talking point. Some people don't do the savings challenges and stuff like that. Um, and some people don't plan. You know, it's just too much. So, Or they do it all on their phone kind of a thing. So... There we go. And this one here, I might even do up here like this. All right, see it's coming together. Cute. Okay, so maybe her over here. So I don't even really have to use that flower thing, but I just wanted to bring some more of those colors in. So I was thinking, it's not that bad like that. And I might even put a box down in here. So let's see what we got. I'm starting to feel it. It's making me happy. You know that when things kind of come together and you're like, yeah, yeah, that's what I want. It doesn't always work like that, right? And you just got to... Okay. I think I want to use green check boxes too. Oh, now I can't find the... There we go. Nope, that's the wrong green. I need a deeper green. Okay, well, I'm going to grab one of these check boxes really quick. Because I know I want to do one of these. I want it over here. I almost could do it like that, huh? One here. Okay. There's another one. I think that I want to do it over here. Next to our sassy redhead. Struggling, <laughs> goodness. And I, I honestly, I think I would be having so much of a hard time if I had my long nails on. Oh, come on, come on, you little booger. Here we go. There we go. Um, I think I wanted to get my other box down first. So let's see. Oh, cool. We got some green dots if we need them. Let me find. Oh, 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 oh. That might be a good green. Maybe. Okay. Let's see here. Ooh, kind of like this circle. Okay, let's see. And there's a cool green too. That's cool. I think I'm gonna use that at some point. With a little shamrock next to it. How cute is that? Put that right there for a second. Okay, all right, well at least we're finding options. That's a good thing. I 
I like that too. That's cute. Maybe. Come on. Um, stars, lips, ice creams, roses, rainbows. Oh, I see the rainbows without... I see the difference. There we go. Okay, come on now. Oh, look how cute. But it's not the right color. Hmm. Those aren't bad either. Let's see, I think it's just going to be... It's not bad. I might do that. Let's see how this goes. How was I doing this? Something like... I almost feel like I need to leave the... some room at the top. That. And then maybe her like that. How did I have that? Like, like that. Yeah, we're gonna go just like that. It's gonna cover up some of my little um, trackers, but. That's okay. I'll live without them. Ugh. This part does drive me nuts, though. Sorry. So sorry. So sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I do that, because I can't stand it when people apologize. I'm so sorry for taking so much time. Honestly, it's one of those things, like, if you're still sticking around, it's because you're having a good time. If you're not here, then you're not even going to hear me say sorry, right? So... If you're here, I thank you. That's what I say. <laughs> Come on. Be good to me. Almost. Come on. I can feel it. There we go. There we go. Yes. Okay, that's not that bad. It's kind of cute. And then I'm gonna do some some shamrocks. I think I want like a box up in here. Do I have any more boxes? Hmm. Oh yeah, we were looking at those green ones and the or the circles even. Where were those ones at? Right. They're back for her. So the question is, do I want a box or a circle? I think I might even go circle. Oh, I could use like yellows even, huh? No. Yellow does remind me of gold. Like the, let me try it. Let me give it a go. I might even do two. Let's see what this looks like. Let's see. Gonna have some fun with some circles. See what we can put together. Oh, I'm getting all sorts of crazy. Maybe they need to be together more. Or higher. All right. I kind of like it. I 
kind of, it does kind of clash with these ones over here, but I'm almost about to change out these for some more circles because those are fun. I'm going to do that. Okay. We're going to call this little sassy redhead Miss Lola. That's my, one of my besties. And she's she's a sassy redhead. If you guys follow my channel, you know that the the scratcher, no, it's not a, it's the roll and save. Um with the pinup that's laying down against the car. That's Miss Lola. That's her car. Okay, so this goes away. I might even be able to put that here. Get some use out of it still, you know? Okay, it's crooked, but I'll deal with it. Okay, circles, more circles. Feeling it. This time we'll swap them differently. Okay. I think like that. It's definitely different. I don't think I don't think I've ever done anything like this before. Um, do I want to do this guy down here? Just for fun. Just for funsies. I don't think so. I'm not feeling it. It's, it's screwing up my vibe. <laughs> I'm having fun with this though. Okay, we got like a little functional area right here. I'm gonna write some stuff here. I think I just need some of the um the shamrocks. Those were in this other book. Just to kind of splatter around. I'm feeling it. Okay, so I've got four. That's kind of cute. I almost wish there was a shamrock small enough to put on her hair. <laughs> it just covers her up too much. I might do it here. Let me just fix this because it is crooked. Or, you know, maybe. Okay. Um, where else? Let's see here. I feel like I just still need like a little box or something there. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just being too finicky. Let's do one right here between those two. Oh, I like it. How fun. Okay. Not much to, rem to write on Monday, but whatever. There's some space right here. A little bit of space on Tuesday, plenty Wednesday, Thursday, plenty Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We've got some space. Oh, and this is all in the notes area, so we're fine there. I do have some packages coming in next week. Yeah, let's get um, my pen out for me to write the dates down. And you guys are welcome to leave if you want to. Otherwise, you can hang out while I do this. Um, thank you guys for hanging out. Tomorrow is Monday Minis. Make sure you guys stick around and come on back for that. Oh, what's the date? Oh, I'm forgetting. I think... The 11th, 11th, 12th, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Yep. Okay. So we just go backwards then, huh? 17. getting quiet again. All right, and then we've got
God. There we go. March. We'll do the 2023. There we go. All right. I think that's pretty fun. I'm almost thinking I might even do a border at the bottom here. That might tie it in a little bit more. You guys don't stick around if you want to. I'm still here. Otherwise, have a wonderful week. And I hope to see you guys tomorrow for um, Monday minis. Yeah. And then Tuesday, I'm doing March Madness. So come on back that day as well. Wednesday is cash stuffing, the cash wallet Wednesday. It's it's going to be lots of fun. So make sure that you guys are subscribed. And then, uh, yeah, come on back. And make sure you say hello, hello below in the comments because I definitely, I respond to everyone. I respond to everyone. Okay, bye you guys.